So is the future of AGI in the hands of Meta? Wow, we had to find out. Hello, I'm Brent Worth, CTO of Substrate AI, and today we're gonna to explore more into Meta's new transitioning, yet again, to a focus on AGI now. Let's see what that means, and do they have what it takes to actually be a major player in this space? In the ever-evolving world of AI, today we're seeing that Meta's now reorganizing itself to become a major player in the artificial general intelligence world, AGI. AGI is arguably the most important technology that we as humans will ever create, potentially the last, as some have said, and their effort into this direction is a significant one because they have such large resources to be able to put into these projects in both intellectual as well as financial which certainly makes them a major contender. In a recent announcement by Mark Zuckerberg from Meta, they announced that they're gonna combine the AI fundamental team and the product teams together to be able to push and accelerate their effort to create the technologies and algorithms to be able to create the first or one of the numerous artificial general intelligence. Given their ambitious goal of acquiring over an insane amount of GPUs in the next year, a total of around 600,000 GPUs to be exact, they definitely will be a major contender, the major player in the AI computation space. A key aspect of Meta's involvement in AGI research is their discovery that LLMs that are trained on software related problems and programming tasks learn how to reason at a level that is significantly beyond what a standard model would learn or acquire using just language and text alone. That something involved, something in the learning how developers break down problems, perform logical tasks, and be able to create sequence of tasks and break into smaller, take large tasks and break them down to smaller tasks has actually had a very positive influence on the way the LLMs perform logically on complex problems in mathematics, theory, complex um, language problems, which is very exciting. The inclusion of coding skills in current LLM models has shown to have a clear improvement in the efficiency and quality of their performance on a broad range of tasks. Meta, with its computational, intellectual, and financial resources stands to truly become a major player in the AGI race and should be something exciting to watch. As Meta steers its ship towards AGI, is truly adding just coding skills enough to actually get us to across the finish line to AGI? We don't think so. At Substrate AI, was using Serenity Star, we're exploring a more biologically inspired approach where we don't need large language models to solve complex problems. Rather, what we need is a set of algorithms that break down how we reason in a similar fashion as humans. Our current tests have shown to have some very interesting behavior generated from this, where the agent, without knowing that the information it's generating, actually questioned the validity of that statement from the LLM and entered a step where it's actually asking for confirmation that that information is actually correct. We all know this as hallucination and has been a major problem for all LLM-based products as of right now. To have our technology demonstrate this in just its nascent form is truly exciting, especially since I did not put that in there. Going forward, these bio-inspired architectures, I think are gonna prove a great deal of fruit, but combine that with current LLM advancements will truly create a powerful piece of technology going forward. However, as powerful it is, as it is, our goal is not to necessarily create the largest LLM. After all, humans got to this point in our lives without having to memorize the entire internet as well as Stack Overflow. So obviously there's something missing from the current algorithms that we are deploying in LLMs. But that doesn't mean that we can't use or leverage these technologies with advanced algorithms to and reasoning. This could be considerably more powerful than just the individuals working on it alone. And it's very exciting to see how this actually evolves going forward. I'm Brent Worth. Thank you for joining us today on another episode of AI Weekly, semi-weekly, hopefully AI Weekly. Don't forget to hit click subscribe and like or something like that somewhere.